Hey guys, it's Jackson Mega One Two Three here, and um, welcome back to Sally Face. I'm sorry it's been a while since I've uploaded a video. I haven't been feeling well, and I think you guys can probably hear it in my voice. But my throat is a bit scratchy, and my nose is very clogged. But yeah, let's just get into it. Also, let me turn up the volume a little bit. That's good. Okay, I guess we'll get started. Very interesting. What? What is going on? <laughs> is that his mom? Yep. Don't wander so far, sweetie. I want to see the doggy, mom. Can't you hear him? Why don't you wait until your father gets here, okay? He should be here any minute now. But I really want to see it. Please. Please, can I go pet the doggy? Oh, alright, Sal. Just give me a second to get my purse. Then we can go together. Yay, I'll wait over there by the trees. By what trees? I see I see very few trees. Uh, okay, now there's a lot of trees. What was that? Was that the dog? That what happened to my face? What happened to the world? Oh god. Where is my face? Why is my face covered in red? I'm guessing that's blood. Er, no. 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 That's ketchup. Everyone, that's ketchup. It's not blood. It's very much... <coughs> ketchup. No. Oh god purse I guess it's his mom's purse and it, the oh god what the hell Ugh. that there's a lot of ketchup there why is there so much ketchup oh wait actually before I continue with this video because I forgot to in the last episode I need to put a disclaimer um, there is a lot of very gory, um, adult language, and a lot of other really bad stuff. I would advise asking your parents before you watch it. So, yeah, just be warned. Miss Anderson, thank you so much for coming to help me with the toilet. No problem, Miss Anderson, I have, I have it, I'll have it unclogged in no time. Wonderful. Herman normally would have taken care of it himself, but unfortunately his fingers have turned into banana peels. <coughs> and the street corner is just so dangerous. I understand. Thank you so much, Larry. The bathroom is just over there. So I'm guessing I'm taking place of Larry right now. Oh yeah, I'm seeing it through Larry's eyes, I'm guessing. Where's the door? And also, that's a very disgusting looking toilet. Okay, then. What the hell? Um. Can I jump? Hey, wait a second. Okay, real quick. I'm going to zoom into or move the camera to be th there if this works. You guys see that eye? Um, I guess I should put it in the middle of the screen. Yeah, you see the eye? Okay. Um, let me fix this now. Uh, um. Okay, um, I think that's right. Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's Jacksepticeye's eye. That there's... A ladder. What's well, past that ladder? What the hell? A pony. You there. You there. Please help me. What's wrong? The water. It stopped. So thirsty. Don't worry, I know how to fix this. Please hurry. My voice fit perfectly for that. Okay, so I'm guessing I have to go up the ladder. Uh, what's this way? Oh god, is this a maze? 
I really hope not. What is this? Switch? Oh no, don't tell me. Don't tell me I have to flip the switches in a certain order. Because otherwise this is going to freaking suck. Well, first it's that switch. Okay, what's up here? Let's go this way. Nothing. This switch? Yep. Now for the one in the bottom. Also, I need to fix my microphone real quick. Okay, that's better. Yeah, I'm sorry if my commentary is really bad for this video. As I said, I haven't been feeling the greatest, and my throat is really sore. I really hope I don't have COVID. I don't know if I said this, but I actually did it once catch COVID. And it wasn't that long ago either, and it was really painful. What the hell? Um, okay, I don't think it's thirsty anymore. I think it's dead, if anything. Er, um... No, it's just sleeping. Just sleeping. But, uh, yeah, um... I did catch COVID, and it is very painful. So, please, guys, wear a mask and get the vaccine if you can. No, this is not an ad, but just please. What the hell? Okay, then. Um. Um, okay. Uh, uh. This is very weird camera, but okay. <laughs> the hell? Darkness. Sal, come closer. I have something to show you. I know you touched my pony. I thought we were friends, Sal. Oh! Yeah, that right there is what I'm talking about. There's a lot of disturbing images in this game. That's episode two now, yay! The wretch, the wretched, yeah, the wretched. Man, you're still having these nightmares. I haven't had them this bad since right after my mom died. I really think it's this building. There's something off about it, dude. I know you're so insistent about it, but I really don't think this place is haunted. I've been here for most of my life and haven't seen any ghosts, but, er, but. But what? Well, we've known each other for a while now. I have to show you something. Come on. I've never been able to go past right here. Or right now. Past about right here, I think, is where he's usually at. Just go outside. Also, I, I think you guys might have noticed, but I changed my profile picture to be Sally Face. But yeah. Whoa. How come you've never told me about this? It's where I go when I need to be alone. Oh, God. <coughs> it's my fortress of solitude. That's a tree house. Awesome. Climb. This is so cool. I always wanted a treehouse when I was younger. Yeah, my dad built this for me before he disappeared. Wait, what? What do you mean, disappeared? One day he was here and everything was okay, and the next day he was just gone. No, no, no nothing. So he went to go get the milk. <laughs> I'm sorry, bad joke. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm 
Yeah. And all of his things were still here. His clothes, his tools, his wallet, his driver's license, everything. He just disappeared. <laughs> uh, darn, I'm so sorry, Larry. I know how hard that is. Did your parents not get along? No, my parents loved each other. They hardly even fought or anything. It isn't, it isn't what it sounded like. My dad didn't leave us. Even if that's what my mom chooses to believe, I know he wouldn't ever leave us like that. He loved us. <laughs> I believe you. So what do you think happened? Look, you know I'm not generally superstitious, and I know you and Chug swear that the apartments are haunted, but... Well, I think it's something else. Like what? I haven't told many people about this, but I know I can trust you, Sal. I know you won't judge me. Of course not. I might judge you, though. <laughs> no, I'm not much of a judgy person. You don't judge me, I don't judge you. That's how it goes with me. The day before he disappeared, I did something I'm not too proud of. My parents got some firecrackers, and they told me so many times to wait for them, not to play with them on my own, but I just couldn't resist, dude. I lit a few out back, and no no one ended up in Mrs. Gibson's open. And one ended up in Mrs. Gibson window, Gibson's window. It, it killed her pet rabbit. Oh. Oh, man, that's rough. Yeah, so I ran to check on Mrs. Gibson, and she was screaming at me like crazy as if I needed another reason to... To screw off. That old bag, that old bag, oh, screw off, make that old bag mad, I felt horrible though, that poor bunny, anyway, as I was coming down in the elevator, that's when I saw the demon, the demon, the de <laughs> why did my, I, why did I just sound mid midwestern, the demon, he reached out and touched me, I got the super cold chill down my whole body. I was scared. Shirtless, dude. I thought I was losing my mind. He was gone as quick as he came, just as the doors opened. So the reason I'm stopping a lot is for the swear words or bad words is because my parents don't want me to say them. And um, it takes me a second to figure out a word to come up instead of that. Uh, I thought I was losing my mind. He was gone as quick as he came, just as the doors opened. He cursed me because of what I did. He cursed me. Everything in my life was screwed after that. My dad disappeared. My mom stopped talking for a while. I had to spend two weeks in juvie for accidentally killing that rabbit. My bike got stolen. Or my bike got stolen. I missed so much school. I had to take summer classes. It's been one bad thing after the next. Yikes. Ever since then, horrible things have happened to me or, or around me. So you think this curse took your dad away? I know how it sounds, but I know it's true. It's all my fault. My dad, the rabbit, Miss Anderson, everything. Excuse me. Whoa, hold on, man. Even if there is some kind of curse on you, you can't blame yourself for every bad thing that happens. It's not all your fault. Sorry, I just drank a lot of water right before this. I haven't drinking much today. Except for a 20 ounce of Sprite and a 20 ounce of Cherry Coke. I know I don't have the healthiest lifestyle, but... I'm not that bad looking. It's not all your fault. What did this demon look like? It was like nothing I've ever seen before. It was like a moving shadow, all black and misty. But had the form of a man. guys y y y y we saw that I'm sorry it sounded like a child and the eyes were the worst part the deep red eyes that pierced right through you holy crap what I've seen it too I've seen your demon no way when I swear I've seen it in this building just like you described I bet it's linked to the other ghosts too I don't know dude what if we break this curse of yours how would we do that? Maybe there is some clues around that could help. We can try to find out more about the ghost, see if we can get to the bottom of this. Sure, why not? I've got nothing to lose. I 
can I interact with anything besides talking to Larry? Picture. What the? What the hell? Um, if you guys look in the top corner, you'll see the little... Uh, the, the thing is... What the hell? Okay, I'm gonna move that to the center of the screen real quick. Okay, you've had enough time to look at it. I need to fix the video now. That should be good. Hmm, that's strange. What is that? I found this weird Gear Boy cartridge in the Lost and Found box a while ago. I think it reacts to supernatural activity. That was one of the last pictures we took together not long before he disappeared. Hmm, I better keep looking. Cabinet. A bunch of nature and outdoorsy mag magazines. Seems like Larry's dad is the opposite of my dad. The magazines are all old from six years ago or more. Doesn't look like anything too useful though. Let's see what else is in here. A uh, worn leather jacket. There's a couple of old concert tickets in the pocket. I guess that's where Larry gets his taste in music. Seems like a nice way to bond. I don't think I've even watched a concert on TV with my dad, let alone go to one live. There's some kind of weird small box in here. Looks like it's sealed shut. Uh, take. What's in the box? I have no idea, man. It belonged to my dad. It's some kind of puzzle box. Never could figure out how to open it, though. Looks like there's a piece missing. Oh yeah, you're right, I never noticed that before. Do you mind if I hold on to this? Nah, go ahead. Cool. Um, what's inventory? Just let me know if you get it open. Of course. A puzzle box that belonged to Larry's dad. It's missing a piece so I can get it open. So I can't get it open right now. Interesting. chest. I got this weird box from here. It doesn't seem to... Oh. Cabinet. Nothing useful in there. Anything else to interact with? Let me move my mic closer to me. There we go. That's better. It's getting pretty cold. We should head back inside now. Uh, my nose is getting stuffy. I think I might have his knees. Nope. False alarm? Yep. <coughs> but I had a cough. It's getting pretty cold. We should head back inside now. Ready when you are. Plus, I don't think I've said this on, uh, but um, I am going to be getting a gaming mouse here on Thursday. So, today's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Four days. And a mouse pad, because right now I have this old wired mouse. It works just fine, but it's a bit loud. I'm gonna look around and see what else I can find out. Okay, sounds good. I sort, I sort of have to stay here and take care of my mom. She's super sick. Oh, yeah, I noticed that. Well, let me know if there's anything you need. Thanks, Sal. Lee. That's a strange picture. are all the pictures from the first dream. I remember that. I should ask Megan if she knows anything about this game, and I hope she'll come out today. Oh, Megan. That's right. I want to go talk to Lisa first. Hey, Lisa. Feeling any better today? Oh, hi, Sal. I think today it might be the worst of it. Once I'm over this hump, I'll be right as rain. Which is good, because there's so much work to be done. I'm just itching to get back to it. Take it easy for now and get some rest. Oh, don't you worry about me, Sal. I've been pl I've been resting plenty, and Larry's been so helpful, too. I'll be just fine. So, 
Sorry about that. Me and my my computer is in the same room that my brother sleeps in, so every now and then my brother moves around and crap, and it's like, I don't know what time it is. I think it's like, it's 4.30 in the morning right now. I haven't been to sleep yet. I'm tired as all hell, but I got videos to record. Time to go upstairs. Hi, Jack. Or Chug, what are you, Chug? What are you up to? Hi, Sally Face. I'm waiting for the snack guy to fill the machine. Can't start my Saturday without chocolate. I hear ya. I like to start off the weekend. I like to start the weekend off with video games and cartoons. Did you see the new Rico's Modish Wife episode? Yeah, that was great. I love that show. Me too. I like to start my day off by going back to sleep, to be perfectly honest. I don't like waking up, especially when I'm sick. I need to go to the top floor. Um, let's see if I can remember what room, what, where it is. Is it 503? Oh, I forgot. Shifts is Larry. Larry, Sally face. Larry face. so stupid. I think this is the right room. What the hell? Nope. Don't think it's the right room, but still creepy as all hell. And I don't think I've ever had access to this room. What about the others? Locked. So, 503. Three then locked. Five oh four open. I should call Larry up here so he can meet Megan. Then he'll have to believe that Addison apartments are haunted. Larry, you there? I'm here. What's up? Can you come up to four oh five? Sure. My mom just took her medicine, so she'll be passed out for a while. Anyways, I'll be right up. So, what is it that you wanted to show me? Come on, she's in the bathroom. She? Just come on. Damn. D oop. Oopsie. I hope my parents don't watch this. These fifth floor rooms have seen better days. Shh. What? Just wait a minute. Megan, are you here? Hello? I want you to meet my friend Larry. I don't think there's anything in here, dude. You might be afraid. She can be pretty shy, though. I haven't, though, I haven't been able to get her to come out in a while now. I hope she's okay. So, you come up to this moldy bathroom to talk to a dead girl. How often do you come up here? I've been able to talk to her a few times, but like I said, she hasn't been around lately. I'm not crazy, Larry. I'm going to prove this to you. Hey, I never said you were crazy, man. As weird as this is, I believe you, okay? You're my me you're my best bud, and if this helps at all with finding my dad, then I'm all for it. I really thought we'd be able to get her to talk today. Uh, I just had this feeling. Dude, you know who you should go talk with? Todd. Todd? He's probably the smartest kid I know, and he's also on supernatural stuff like you are. I bet he could help somehow. Todd, really? Or Todd, really? Huh. I never expected that he would believe in that stuff. He always seems so normal. Rational. Huh, yeah, I guess so. Okay, well, I'll go talk to him and see what I can find out. Alright, I'm gonna head back downstairs to make sure my mom's alright. Let me know if you find anything. Will do. You know what? I have a question. <coughs> oh, God. I have a question of the day for you guys. Do you believe in the paranormal? That's my question for you today. Do you believe in ghosts, spirits, any of that stuff? I'm genuinely curious. I personally sort of do. It's complicated for me. I don't want to get too much into detail, though. If you get this video to 20 likes, I'll, I'll get into detail. 
Sound good? Okay, good. By the next episode. Which I don't know when I'm uploading that. But where is Todd? Two. Because wild guess. I do not know. Found it first try. What the hell? Todd. Hey, Sally Face. Sorry it took me a minute to answer. I was wrapping up a tutorial session with Ashley. Have you two met? Hey, I'm Ash. You must be Sally Face. I've heard so much about you. I, um, me. You have? Yeah, all good things, I swear. I'm glad I got finally got... Bleh, I'm now starting to stutter. I'm glad I finally got to meet you. Me too. Or, you, or, um, I mean, it's nice to meet you. It's nice to you meet you as well. Well, I'd love to stay and chat more, but I have to get going. Thanks for helping me out today, Todd. No problem. We can work on algebra next week. Sounds good. I'll see you guys later. Hopefully, I'll run into you again soon, Sally Face. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Enjoy the weekend, boys. You too. You alright, Sal? You seem a bit anxious. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm cool. Okay, so what brings you this way? Ash seems nice. Is she a freshman too? What is she like? Her full name is Ashley Campbell. She's a freshman like us and an overall nice person. She has some trouble with math, so I've been tutoring her for the past couple of weeks. In exchange, she occasionally assists me with my art assignments. She sounds like a great friend. Sure, I suppose so. You didn't come here to talk about Ashley, though, so what's up? Oh, right. <laughs> I see dead people does not sound like the, the way you should go with. <laughs> you know what? Just for laughs, I see dead people. Are you referring to Mr. Mrs. Sanderson? No, it's something else. This building is haunted, and I'm trying to find out more about the ghosts here. Ah, I see. Oh my god, I can't believe I just said, I see dead people. Okay. <coughs> um... I need, I need your help. Thank you for telling me your story. I think I may be of some assistance with your exploration of the paranormal. Specifically, I have a solution. A suspicion that an apparition resides in my bathroom. Huh? Really? Yes, it does seem to be a strange coincidence that your Megan and my apparition are both found in bathrooms. However, it could also be that the water pipes act as some sort of conductor for them, though that is only speculation on my part. Do you have the Gear Boy cartridge with you? Yeah. Perfect. Let's go check out the bathroom. What do you usually do to call upon Megan? Does the Gear Boy always light up when she's near? It doesn't light up every time. Usually it just starts... I just start talking to her. Sometimes she comes out, sometimes she doesn't. Okay, go ahead and try the same thing here so we can attempt to summon the spirit. Hello, is anyone here with us? We're not going to hurt you. We're your friends. Hello, is anyone there? Nothing is happening, and the game isn't lighting up either. Hmm, I have an idea. Let me see that. I bet I can modify your gear boy to help better detect supernatural hotspots. Cool, sounds good to me. I'll need two things in order to complete the alteration. First, I'll need something to amplify the device's reception, and second, something to boost its electrical output. So, like an antenna and a battery pack. Sure, I'll be in my room once you're ready. Where the hell am I gonna find an antenna and a battery pack? Okay, the same dialogue there. Okay. 
um, um, parents must be hippies. No, I can tell they are hippies. Yep, especially the dad. Um, um, don't mind this right here, guys. It's, um, um, it's something for adults. Leave Todd's parents' room. Todd's parents are in there. I don't want to bother them. Yeah, seeming as though they're hippies, probably a smart idea. I'll go see Todd. Talk. Will this work for reception? Will this work for power? A key card, a walkie talkie. Hmm, the antenna is a bit too small for our purposes. Okay, good. Key card. Although the card does have a magnetic strip, I'm afraid this won't work for what we need. Puzzle box, yeah. That's an interesting box, but we'll need something longer and much thinner. Um. Yes, the battery from your walkie-talkie will work perfectly. Good thinking, Sally Face. So, I'm guessing I can no longer... Oh, sticky keys. Sorry, that was sticky keys from spamming shift for some stupid reason. <coughs> um, actually, let me see how long this video's been going on. 31 minutes already? You know what? I think that that right there is a perfect, maybe? Eh, uh. Okay, I'm gonna try something real quick, please. Main menu. Please save. Fingers crossed, everyone. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so, yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Answer the question of the day, do you believe in the paranormal? Um, hit the bell, and, um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye!